Hello creative mind, welcome home. I'm Survival. In the last class I showed you how you can edit templates in in canvas, how you can edit it, tune it, adjust it and use it to get what you want. Today I will be showing you how to create or how to make a design of your own from the scratch. So I believe you were able to edit a lot of templates in the last class which might actually help you in uh, grabbing and understanding this class very well without wasting much time let's get to work so we open our canva now in the last class i showed you how you can create uh, you can edit templates you just simply tap on any any of these templates here and then click on edit now to create a design of your own from the scratch this is what you do you take a look at the bottom of the screen at the tail end of the screen you will notice a black circle with a white cross a white plus inside simply click it when you click it it will open a new page like this so now here you can do a lot of things here when you click on this uh, 1080 by 1080 you will be able to use it to edit the size so by clicking it you can edit it this is the size and measurements maybe if you are used to cm or inches or millimeter or pixel you can choose any one you are comfortable with and then here you can edit the width the height and whatsoever when you are done getting the size you want you click on this and with that it will take you back to your canvas so now to start designing you click on you tap on this uh, plus here maybe first of all you want to add a background image so with this let's take a background okay think i'll use this for my background so you can resize this your background note with this you can you'll be able to rotate it you can rotate it anyhow you want so again and with any of these edges here you'll be able to resize it to increase it so you can see it i'm just increasing it okay it has occupied the whole canvas now so when you are done doing that uh, you want to add another image there you click on this plus again on image and then i'll select this image actually i've used the background uh, uh, i mean the distant background changer to change the background of this uh, of this image so you can see it there is no background there can just simply put it like this okay something like this okay i think what i want to do now is to make a design to design a fashion something that has to do with something that has to do with fashion okay so now now click on this put in text so now there are already a lot of custom text here that you can pick from you can see it has to be 38 but there are a lot of custom tests i mean templates you can all you can pick from but like i said today we are designing from the scratch so you will notice on top of it this adds some text of your own so you just click it okay what should i write now okay you tap on this on the this thing in order to give you option to to edit it to type on it okay i will just put something like my love let me start it with capital letter my love okay so having done that i'll click on this good again and then bring it up this is it my love what i want to write is this my love for fashion okay i'll click on this and then with this plus again i'll add another 
text so i'll put in another text so um, add some text of your own that's what i'm using so i'll just put write for f o r and i think since it's fashion i need something that is a bit uh something that a bit is a bit stylish so i'm trying to change the font now something that is a, a bit fancy that is the right words to use since it's something about fashion okay i'm looking for a font that is too fancy okay i think i'll go with this allura of 18 i think that's okay so this is it so i'll increase it a bit my love for and then put it here okay that's for that and then fashion i'll put in fashion again with that i'll just click on this good and then tap text again okay add some text of your own i'll write fashion okay fashion okay and then i want to change the font again to change the font you click on this uh, lower arrow so i want something so bold in order to bring out the beauty of the fashion okay i want something that is thick and bold should i go for this okay let me just go for this alpha slab okay my love for fashion i think i'm okay with this so i'll just increase this a little bit okay I'm okay with it and then this so it's just something like this with this i've been able to come up with a very simple design you know what makes design very good is something simple when you use a lot of things you add a lot of stickers a lot of uh, whatever a lot of stickers and other things it doesn't make a good design so i'll still add some other things in order to make it not so simple in order to make it at least good so now i'll be using some custom text okay this one is online sale should i use okay let me use white cell so i'll pick this white cell it's too big for my liking so i'll just put it this way okay i want to reduce it okay so i'll just leave it something like this or maybe yeah i think something like this i can i can even bring it down here so just something as simple as this believe you can see it with this i've been able to come up with a very simple design this design is simple and it looks okay it's very simple and it's looking okay so the design is simple and is actually looking okay so this is it as simple as this maybe if you have a logo you can add up the logo somewhere else i think i love this my design so this is how you make your designs you know one the one way to grow in designing is this each time you come across any flyer any brochure any banner any design at all you just stop and take a look at the design you stop and take a look at the design when you must have done that you see how the designer combined one or two components it will register in your head whenever you are designing you see yourself bringing in those things to make designs and with that you see yourself growing and advancing in design so this is how you create uh, you create your own design in canva you can actually want to put uh, some of these things video sticker this is the sticker option okay you can maybe this one il illustration this is what it looks like okay this one frame 
you see these are frames is still loading my internet is poor you get or uh, maybe logos or page so if your design is more than one page you can actually click on this to add another page to it so you see this one becomes the front this one becomes the back and then you start another design here so i believe these are the basic things you need to know about making designs in canva how i love this my design you see it is very simple and it's very very nice this is how your designs ought to be as you see as you move around take a look at other designs and see how they do it and then with that you'll be getting one or two ideas on how to design so i believe i've introduced you to the basic things you need to know about designing in canva so as you explore the app you get to advance and learn more so for your assignment try to create a unique figure using either the office app the boyfriend dress up and then after doing that you remove the background with our background changer and then you use the image to make a cool design so i want you to make a design on fashion a design on music a design on or maybe a carnival and something like that so that will be for your assignment thank you so much for watching so we we'll see you next class sorry again there are some things i didn't show you here you can change colors brand colors here you can filter if i touch this one now you see the way it filtered my image believe you can see it so you can even go for advanced filter so you can just explore all this so that's the much i can show you for now these are the basics as you explore it you get to learn more thank you so much for watching see you next class god bless you